Unfortunately, I think in one word, what it's going to take is probably a lot of time. As you know, Hillary Clinton, way back in 1992, started this idea, and we all know what happened to it. I know that there will be a lobbying battle like you've never seen before um, concerning single-payer health care. I do believe and I hope that we're going to have a Democratic president, and I hope that this will become a priority, and either incrementally or hopefully faster than that, we will get to it. Absent that, in this state, as all three of us have said, we would move toward a single-payer health care system. I think it's the only way to go. You know, I, I was talking to Michelle uh, a year ago or more uh, about this very issue, and I was very skeptical. But as the Lewin Group report shows, there's billions of dollars that can be saved here. Of course, the debate isn't going to be framed that way. It would seem to me that providers and patients and business people, you know, I, I told a guy at his door the other day, if I was a Republican businessman who had to pay health insurance for all of my employees, I'd be more than willing to listen to what a single-payer system provides, as well as, you know, all of the other groups. And, and of course, the bottom line for this is that we have 800,000 uninsured Coloradans, many of them children, many of them senior citizens. It's morally wrong, but it also seems to me to make economic sense to have this system in Colorado. So I'm certainly an advocate for it, but again, back to your question, I think it's unfortunately going to take a lot of time.